Hello everyone. This is EC252. That is digital electronic circuit lecture. Now today we will see how state diagram is used. So one circuit is given. This is the circuit. Now we will first take the thing how the state of the flip flop. We can see here we are having two flip flop. One is producing the output that is the state of this flip flop is A. Another is the D flip flop here its state is B. So this is the two flip flop whose state is important and the input is X and the output is Y. So in this case we will analyze this circuit. So we can see for A, A is the output of a D flip flop. So whatever may be the input of D flip flop, the same output will have the output as A. So we need to know what is the input here. Now we can see the input here is coming from this OR gate. Now this OR gate is addition of two AND gate. Now these two AND gate, the first AND gate has one input. This is the point and it is coming here. So it is A. So one input is the expression of A of T plus 1. T plus 1 means the next step. So A of T plus 1 equal to we can see one input here is A that is A of T. T means the present state. And the second input we can see it is X into X. And so this is the this AND gate. And the second AND gate it is one input is X and The second input we can see it is coming from B. So this is the expression for A. Now coming to the expression of B, B is the output of this D flip flop. We know D flip flop is transparent flip flop. So that means whatever the input we are having, the same output we can have ok one thing this will be connected it is not given so this we are giving here the rest of the thing is correct now we can see the output of this D flip plus B is coming from the input of this AND gate now this AND gate, one input is A bar. So B of T plus 1 equal to A bar of T into this is X. Okay, so this is the D flip flop for B. Now coming to the expression of Y. We see Y is coming from this AND gate. That means two thing is multiplied. Now the first thing is this is the OR gate. Now first input is this one. It is B. B of T. T means present state, so it is V and the second is uh, A. So or so it is added A of T and uh, it is ended with this one is X. So into x bar. So x is coming here, it is the x bar. So this two is ended and it is having the output as y. 
so we can see the same thing is given a of t plus 1 equal to a of t into x plus b of t into x and uh, okay and t we can write t just means the time it is actually a into x present state and b of t plus 1 is equal to a bar into x of t so here also we are taking t that because uh, it is also changing with time so it is basically a bar t into x so we are taking as t for the timing and y will uh, a of t plus b of t into x bar Okay. Uh, this actually it is y t plus 1 it is the next step it will be y t plus 1 so what we have written this is the expression of this equation this is the y t plus 1 so now from this expression we are writing this Uh, truth table just it is overlapping just let me write this at this point a of t plus 1 equal to a of t x of t plus x of bt So the same thing we have written here. Now B of T plus 1 equal to A bar T into X of T. Next Y of T plus 1 equal to B of T and A of T. So we can just write A plus B, A of T plus B of T into X bar. So same thing we have written here just to clear the board. Okay, now input is X, present state that is present state of whatever flip flop is present two flip flop is present one is a one is b so x can have zero and one these two value because x is one bit so for x zero and one we are having zero zero that is value of a and b both is zero zero one is for x value zero one is for x value one next we are having a and b 0 and 1 2 because 1 is for x 0 1 is for x 1 next is 1 0 next is 1 1 so now we will have for each combination the x is having first 0 then 1 so both the combination is having now <coughs> What will be the next state? Now, next state of A is A in place plus B in place. So, if X is 0 because A into X plus B into X. So, if X is 0, A into X will be 0, B into X also will be 0, addition of both will be 0. So, whenever X is 0, we can directly write the value of A as 0 so these are zeros what I am giving the line next when x is 1 it is multiplied by A and it is multiplied with B also x of 
E you can write. So x into A plus x into B. Now if value of x is 1, we have to know what is the value of A and B. Now <coughs> A and B both is 0. So it will be 0. Here we can see 1 is 1. So output will be 1. Here also 1 is 1. So output will be 1. Here also, here both is 1, so obviously output will be 1. So, we have taken all the values of A. So, next state of A is coming from this equation. So, A is done. Now, we will take what is the value of B. B is, B next state, B t, t plus 1. The value of B at t plus 1 time, it is a bar of t into x of t. Okay, first as it is multiplied with x of t, so whenever x of t is 0, output will be obviously 0. So, here x is 0, so output is the value of b is 0, x is 0, value of b is 0, x is 0, value of b is 0 x is 0, value of b is 0. Now, whenever x is 1, that time, if value of a bar t is also 1, so it will have output 1, otherwise it will have output 0. So, a bar t have to be 1, that means a will need to be, a need to be 0, a need to be 0. So, here we can see a is 0, so b is 1. Here a is 0, it will produce b as 1. Here a is 1, so it will produce b as 0. a is 1, so it will produce B as 0. So we have taken all the values for B also. Previously we have taken all the values for A. Now we have taken all the values for B. Next coming to Y. Y next state is A plus B whole into X bar. So whole into x bar means whatever may be the addition, if x bar is 0, output will be 0. So that means if x is 1, output will be 0. So whenever x is 1, y will be 0. Now, whenever x is 0, so x bar will be 1. So, that time output may be 1 if 1 of a and b is 1. Okay. So, here both a and b is 0. So, it will produce 0. Here, 1 of them is 1. So, it will produce 1. Here, 1 of them is 1. So, it will produce One here both are one, so it will produce one. So we now got all the values for y also. So for present state of a and b and x, we are getting the next state of a b and y. Now what we will do? We will represent this table into another format. So whatever format we are taking here, previously a, b we take two times because of the value of x. We 
we can have the same value of a and b two times for the value of x one times zero one times one. Now what we are doing? We are changing this. We are breaking x for one to another side, x for zero to another side. So what we are doing? We are taking the value of a b as zero 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 one one zero one. Only four we are taking, not eight. Now what we are doing? X for zero is this expression. X for one is this expression. For a b, how we are doing? Very simple. For x for zero. Next step is zero zero. So for x for zero, next step is zero zero. From zero zero, from zero one, when x is zero, we are having zero zero. So from zero one, we are having next step as zero zero. From one zero, if x is zero. We are having zero zero, so this end. And for one one, if x is zero, we are having again zero zero, so this is the zero zero. Next, we are taking for x equal to one. So for x equal to one, this is zero one. So we can see this is zero one. Next for zero one present state that is for this one. If it is x equal to one, it is coming to one one. So we can have here one one. Next again for one zero. For x equal to one. We can have one zero, so that we are having one zero, and for one one x equal to one, we are having one zero, so we are having one zero. So this is the next step. One is for x equal to zero, and another is for x equal to one. From the same table, we are having. So up to this is done. For the values of a b, next step both for x equal to zero and x equal to one. Next we are taking what is the output the value of y. That is again for x equal to zero as well as x equal to one. Okay, so for zero zero when x is zero, y is zero. So this one for zero one x is zero y is one. This one for one zero x is zero output is one. This one. For one one, x is zero. Output is one. This one. So all the values of y when value of x equal to zero is taken from this table to this table. <coughs> Now what we'll do? We'll fill up this table. That is for x equal to one. So. Whenever the value of a b is zero zero, x is one, output is zero. That is this one. Whenever a b is zero one and x is one, y is zero. <coughs> this one. Whenever present state a b. Is one zero x is one 
output is zero. That is given here. And whenever a B state is one one, input is x is one, output is zero. That is this one. So what we have done? We have reconstructed this table to this table. Previously it was eight row. Now there is there are four rows. So we have make it half because for x equal to zero and one for a b and for x equal to zero and one for y we have separated. So from this table to this table we have we made this table from this table. Reorganizing the values and dividing based on the values of x. Now what we need? <coughs> we need to construct a state diagram. So for representing the state diagram, let us write this second table. One second. The A B. Value is zero 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 one one zero one one, and the next state value a b for x equal to zero for x equal to one. This we are having um, <coughs> the value of. Next a b next a b next a b this is for x equal to zero this is for x equal to one and also we are taking output y that is next y. For x equal to zero and for x equal to one, so what we got uh, this four r zero zero. So first is zero one, next is one one, next two r one zero and one zero. Now output is zero triple one, so it is zero triple one and four zero. Now we will construct state diagram from this. Set table. We know what is called truth table. This is represented the state form, so it is called state table. Now, from this state table, we will draw this state diagram. Now, we can see there are two flip flop or memory element. It is two. So. We can have two digit. So two digit means is it can have two to the power two. That is four state. We can have they are zero 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 one one zero one one. So just we have seen this zero 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 one one zero one one. This four state is there. So we can write. Just then one is zero zero, one is zero one, one is one zero, another is one one. Now we have to construct this state diagram from this state table, and we have to know how we can construct this. Okay, so this we have to write from zero zero. 
next input is 00 so that means 0, 0, 2, 0, 0, same state and for that x is 0 and y is 0 so input is 0, output is 0 next from 0, 0 this present state to next state is 0, 1 so next state is 0, 1 so we from here to here arrow we give and this time x is 1 and y is 0 so it is 1 by 0 first one is input second one is out so first line is done second line is from 0, 1 to 0, 0 so from 0, 1 to 0, 0 so arrow is in this direction and in this case x is 0 and y is 1 so it is 0 by 1 input is 0, output is 1 x is 0, y is 1 next time we go this one so 0, 1, 2, 1, 1 so 0, 1, 2, 1, 1 in this case x is 1 y is 0 so it is 1 by 0 so second line is also done now third line 1, 0, 2, 0, 0 so 1, 0, 2 0, 0 it will go so arrow is in this direction and here input is 0 output is 1 so it is 0 by 1 next coming to this one 1, 0, 2, 1, 0 so that means same state it is taken coming and in this case input is 1 output is 0 so it is 1 0 next so third line is also done fourth line 1 1 2 0 0 1 1 2 0 0 arrow in this direction at this case x is 0 and y is 1 so it is 0 by 1 and it is 1 1 2 1 0 1 1 2 1 0 arrow in this direction and in this case x is 1 y is 0 so so this is the state diagram and we can see the state diagram is just as it is what is we can see here the same thing by arrow by the input output combination so this is how we can construct state diagram from a state table so from today's lecture we have seen if one arbitrary circuit is given from that circuit we can make the equation of number one the whatever is given the flip flop that state and number two is whatever the output of the circuit so in this case there are two flip flop so it is a and b so what are their equation for next state for a and b 
this we have written from the diagram from the circuit diagram itself and what is the output from this diagram we have made a elaborate state table and then we reorganize the state table in a format like this in a condensed form and next in this state table from this state table we constructed every bit to the state diagram one by one so what is the previous state and what is the next state we constructed one by one so like this in today's lecture we have seen how from circuit to state equation to state table to state diagram formation thank you